with elephant-like snouts. Right, pull over in the car park to your right and go exploring. Take a stroll in our Lima walkthrough, where our ringtone is even more memorable. Don't forget, the African village is also your last opportunity to answer the call of nature before your safari gets underway. Right, that's what I'm doing. after spending almost 50 years performing in a circus. At Longmead, Anne receives the best... Spots the reddish-brown cows. Can you see them yet? They're the ones with the magnificent horns being Kapluk, a giant version of the classic game where Anne has to pull out sticks using her trunk in order to get at the tasty fruit hidden inside. When you already see them dry, these horns are put to good use when rival males battle to become leader of the herd. And in the wild, these almighty horns have even been known to overpower. As you continue your drive around the deer park, keep a lookout for our herd of extremely rare Pear Davids deer. If you're near them, take a look at their hooves. Surprisingly big, aren't they? for their impressive so we're really fortunate to have them here at Longleat.
including seven from the company that made the Oscar-winning film Born Free. The rest of the 50. So in here is a pretty substantial pride of lions. A pride is a word that you use to talk about a group of lions. Think of it like an extended family. And they are very unusual amongst the larger cats in that they do stick together in groups made up of both males and females. However, when it comes to hunting, it's the lion and the second that one animal does that, all the bumpy, heavy animal. They can't have chases that last for hundreds of meters. It needs to be over and done with fairly quickly. So you can see them communicating with each other purely through body language, not sound. And when they think the moment is right, one will pounce and they will all go to the company that made the Oscar-winning film Born Free. The rest of the years later. However, when it comes to hunting, it's the lionesses that do all the work. Recognize that girl? Out. It means that the whole pride becomes less efficient and less able to catch food. So we've talked about the impressive teamwork of the lionesses. I need to keep in track where we are. Okay, so you're now entering the second enclosure of lion country. And in here, there's a totally separate pride. It's very cool. Well, on the face of it, it appears to be something of a disadvantage. For one, it could easily get in the way and become tangled when running through vegetation. And secondly, having one is a bit like us wearing a thick, fluffy scarf on a boiling pot that it makes the male lion look bigger. It makes him appear to be more impressive and more imposing to other male lions. And those are important qualities to have when it comes to settling territorial disputes. Looking back, looking out at us. Oh 
You said you'd take a Oh, you can see the other better here, Dad. It is a tiny little Marcus, you can have my hand back now, Yeah, I He's got his mouth open and there's one in the water looking at me. So there we go. Nice balanced diet. 